Okay, so Tibet wanted to take this piece of armor and kind of bend it over in order to make something that was a thickness of 180. Because right now, if a bullet were to come in and fly through like this, then... It would have to go through 100 millimeters of space, right? So if you bend it over like this, you can see that a bullet coming through would have to go through more than 100 millimeters of space. And specifically, Tibet wanted to, or the problem that Tibet gave us was to try to make it 180 millimeters. Okay, so to be able to do this, we're going to use a little bit of trigonometry, and I'm going to label the angle down here. I'm going to draw in a horizontal line and label this angle as theta. And since this line is horizontal also, the line going through the yellow line up here, that would mean that the angle here would also be theta by alternate interior angles between those two parallel lines. Okay, similarly, or also I should say, if I were to draw in this thickness, it's supposed to be green, why don't you turn it for me? Green distance right here, that's the thickness of the piece of metal, so that would be 100 millimeters, right there. And what this gives us now is a diagram of uh, the situation, and we can now use some trigonometry due to the right angles. So let me draw in the right angle that we know is going to be right here, and so we can try to figure out what the measurement of theta is by performing some trigonometry. Theta is equal to, since from that angle we have an opposite and a hypotenuse, that means that it would be the arc sine of the opposite side, 100 over 180. And that would be the measurement of the angle right here. Now, unfortunately, the way that the problem or the problem was uh, related to the other pieces, I was actually doing it incorrectly the whole time and always finding out this angle. And actually what was being requested was the angle that was over here. Right here. Now this angle would just be the complement to the one that's on that side, but if you want to calculate it directly, you just calculate theta equals arc cosine of the 100 over 180, and that's the calculation that I put into the uh, response to the message. Okay, also of note, this is very generalizable. If you don't want to do 180 millimeters, but you want to do some other size, you could do, for example, cross out the 180, and just do any general x, and finding that general x would be just as easy as replacing the 100 with the x if you wanted this side or the 100 with the x if you wanted this side. And so we no longer have the standing up straight armor, we now have the bent over.